Hello everyone, this is Fizzle15, welcoming you back to another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy XII, and uh, I'm uh, here at the top of the Paravina Riff. Uh, Paramina. Paramina Riff. Um, here at uh, Mount Burk. The fountain, okay. Um, I, I, I just don't like that. I couldn't say these names. But anyway, um, this is where uh, the uh, holy people of this uh, game are at. Uh, it's sort of like a have a given. There's a long streak of cutscenes, so I have no idea exactly where I'm gonna have to cut it and stuff. These are the new boo, or new mal. They are basically the high priests here. Uh, They kind of look like Yoda, I, I think. Um, and uh, before I head to uh, the high priest or what the priest is, I want to show you that uh, for some reason there's a fear right here. I don't know if I. Uh, She's kind of an outcast, or if she's uh, here representing uh, the fear of the woods. I have no idea. But yeah, I'm Final Fantasy Tactics advanced for the GPA. New out are uh, are my favorite characters. So, uh, but uh, at the end of uh, this little hallway um, is uh, where the cutscenes will start. So, um, I think I will uh, uh, meet you. Uh, Back when I can talk uh, a little later, so I will uh, see you then. Is he sleeping? No, my child. Whoa. I do not sleep. I dream. For reality and illusion are a duality. Two parts of a whole. Only the mirror of dreams reflects what is true. Anastasis, your grace. I am Lay Ashelia... Down your words. Ashelia, daughter of Ramanas. I have dreamt your dream. Who better to carry on the Dalmascan line than she who bears the Dawn Shard? Your dream of a kingdom restored is known to me. Grand Kiltius, then give us your blessing. Grant the Lady Ash her I accession to the... This is something you might reconsider. My little emperor in waiting. You called and I have come. Uh, this is the man I wanted you to meet. 
Believe it or not, he is a member of the noble house Margrace, rulers of the Rosarian Empire. I am but one of very, very many. Try as I might, I could not stop this war alone. Thus, I came seeking Lars' assistance. I'll seed Margrace at your service. To think I stand before the Lady Ash, it is truly an honor. Uh. I see it is true after all. Uh, stunning is Dalmasca's desert bloom. Uh. In Arcadia, Larsa. In Rosaria, Al Cid. They dream not of war. Should Empire join with Empire, the way will open for a new Ivelisse in our time. <laughs> Grand Kiltius, you speak much of dreams, but in the real world, war is a bonus. Grand Kiltius, I was told my coming here would prevent this war. I was to assume my father's throne and announce the restoration of Dalmasca, treat with the Empire for peace, and persuade the Resistance to stay their hand. I have not come all this way to be asked to reconsider. A word from you and the Resistance would stop cold, and Rosario's pretexts for joining the war scattered off to the four winds. This was what we had hoped. Alas, circumstances change. A full two years have passed since your reported death. Were it to become known you are still alive, I fear it could only worsen our current situation. Because I am powerless to help. Uh, nay, in fact it has little to do with you. Then what? If Lady Ash were to extend her hand in friendship, perhaps I could then persuade the Emperor. His Excellency will solve things peacefully. The Emperor Gramis is no more. His life was taken. Father...